Hippocrates, it's good you're here. Is it? Look around you. Athens is dying. What do you think is going on? I don't know. What I do know is that it kills without discrimination. Rich, poor, philosopher or farmer, and I'm helpless to stop it. What's happening to the victims? Leaking, postulant rashes, raging fevers, pallid, sweaty skin. I find many dying in their own excrement. Is there nothing that can be done? I try and ease the suffering where I can. The plague is spreading through the victims' excretions. I'm sure of it. The bodies must be burned. Your compassion for the people has always inspired me. Unfortunately, compassion is all I have to give. The gods have shown me how arrogant I had become. We're only mortal, and the gods like to remind us whenever they can. I need help burning the bodies, Alexios. Fanatics are roaming the streets trying to stop me in my work. What fanatics? The followers of Ares. Superstitious fools. They believe burning the dead is sacrilege and attacked me. Can you believe it? These followers of Ares don't worry me. I'll help burn the bodies. but the shade of what it was. Safe from the fanatics. That's all of them.
darf da auf dich und auf Stab. Alexios, you're back. Got to run, sorry. Wait, where? I'll be right back. See you at Aspasias. Sometimes I think you are too much like me. Friends, I know I they are brethren, and you have the right to be. Why do they hide in their houses? Alexios, it's good to have you back. I've never seen anything like this. Those who are killed by the plague run wild in the streets. Death is rampant, and it's only a warning. We have ignored what truly plagues us for too long. Cleon. How can you worry about him at a time like this? Uh, under his reign, Athens will lose the freedom and glory that has put it on the world stage. It is time to turn my words into actions. How? You will find out as soon as I do. Understand! Pericles is a sick man. Don't blame him, Safar. Blame him for bringing this curse that creeps our once great city. We are Athenian! I didn't expect to see you. What do you think you're doing? You're driving this mob to madness. This, this is nothing. I will make Athens great again. Athens' name was once held high in the world. Now, what has it become? Let's return Athens to greatness. We will be feared again. Aspasia. Oh, Alexios. You've returned to Athens. What's left of Athens? The world we've built is crumbling at our feet. It's as loud as a battlefield out there, and as violent. They're calling for Pericles' head, as though he should know how to handle this catastrophe. No one is prepared for the end of the world. I came to talk to you. I found out some things about my mother, her name, her ship. Alexios, it's not the time. Pericles is dying. He won't see me. He won't let Hippocrates in his room. He only babbles about going to his precious Parthenon. Pericles is a strong man. I'm sure he can fight this sickness. You heard the mob. He can't defend himself. He'll die with no glory. Athens has known him a lot longer than they've known this plague. He gave them a voice. His accomplishments will speak for him. <sighs> Pericles needs treatment, and the gods know he won't let me in. He respects you. Could you go to him? I could try. If you do, I will make the time to talk about your mother. For now, he needs your help. It's worth a shot. Alexios. Yes. Come in. It's embarrassing. Someone so strong seeing me like this. I admit you don't quite look yourself. I don't feel like myself either. I brought your drugs. Ah, yes. It's usually Phoebe who does the delivering. At least I'm alive. Though I can't say the same for my city. It's a shadow of what it was. Well, it will belong to Cleon now. He will have to lift it out of its sorry state. I wish to see it with my own eyes. Come to the balcony. Much has changed. I can't even stand up straight to look death in the eye. You'll recover sooner if you let Hippocrates see you. It's my time. The plague chooses is no favorites. I fear I've failed Athens. Its people? Aspasia? No, you haven't. Ah, you're kind, but I've lost. 
Aspasia needs protection, as does Athens. I thought I gave enough to Athena, but it seems it isn't so. I should be out there, on the streets. You'd be overtaken. There are mobs, and Cleon's doing nothing to calm them. Thank the gods, Cleon won't see me like this. But that's all I can thank the gods for. They've turned on me. The gods definitely aren't in Athens. I hardly recognize it here. It's like the Tartarus. Athens' fate is decreed. All we can do now is wait. You should go back inside. You need to rest. Where I should be is in the Parthenon, my greatest legacy to Athens. We need the gods' blessing. But Aspasia... Aspasia's right. She often is. But not about this. Yes. I'll go inside. Thank you, Alexios. Tell my Aspasia I was a good boy and took my drugs. I will. Pericles let me in. He took his drugs without complaint. Thank you. Something wrong? I expected Phoebe back by now. I saw her in the crowds outside. Did you send her somewhere? I had her go to Anastasios to see about a ferry. As soon as Pericles is strong enough, we're leaving Athens. We have to. But now she's missing. I'm sure she's all right. Aspasia, there's a plague. You've seen the streets. She's just a child. Give her the credit she deserves. She's more of a fighter than I was at her age. I told Pericles the cult is in Athens. It's too dangerous. The cult? I thought it was the sickness talking. I'm going to look for her. Where is Anastasios' house? It's across from the Odeon of Pericles. Yere. This looks like the place. By the gods, what happened here? Limos must be carrying through on her threat. I'm glad Phoebe wasn't here. Hopefully she's safe. This was savage. Done to send a message.
baby. No! Hey! Stop! Mother of all, I greet you. Adios. Alexios! Are you all right? I need to speak to Aspasia. We must find Pericles first. He's missing. I don't fucking care! Tell me where Aspasia is! Alexios! <sighs> I'm sorry, Phoebe. Aspasia went to find Pericles at the Parthenon. She should be there. I think we'd better go with him. I agree, my friend, I agree. the danger, and she still sent you. I'm sorry, Phoebe. You didn't deserve this. There you are, Alexios. Quickly, Pericles may be inside. What's gotten into you? Phoebe was killed by cult guards before I could get to her. Oh no. Dear Phoebe. She died alone in the street. No, you found her. She wasn't alone. I know how much of a friend she was to you. I won't let them get away with this. You have to fight. For her. Aspasia, you're here. Any sign of Pericles? If he's here, he's inside praying. He refused to stay safe in the villa. Things have gotten even worse in the Agora. 
It's madness. Speak later and act now. Pericles. Go! I'm going to destroy everything you've ever created. Athens is mine. Pericles! Stay out of my way. All is lost now. He was a great man. Perhaps greater than we even knew. We need to get her out of Athens. We'll take my ship. We have to leave. Don't let him die in vain. Never. Stay close, just in case. Stop! Cleon has ordered that no one leave Athens. And he wants Aspasia brought to him. I'm not going. Leave. Don't let them go! Clear now. Let's go. We're going to stay, Alexios. What? Why? My work is here. I can't leave the Athenians in the state they're in. You don't need us to protect Aspasia. Leave Athens to us. The city has been taken. This isn't the Athens you used to know. That is why I must stay. We must begin again. <sighs> You're sure? I have lived as an Athenian, and I will die as an Athenian. Then do something for me, both of you. Of course. Retrieve Phoebe's body. 
Give her a proper burial. Everything she deserves, and more. Thank you. Time to go, Alexios. I expect to see you both again. Alive. The farther we get from Athens, the quieter it grows. As though it's peaceful. But I know better. I'm sorry, Aspasia. About Pericles and Athens. You have no need to apologize. For anything. It feels like... I let everyone down. I didn't get to them quick enough. Didn't make the right decisions. It's not your fault. There's no one to blame but the cult of Cosmos. I'll make each of them beg for mercy before I kill them. That time will come. For now, let us look to the future. Do you have a heading? I was hoping you would help me with that. Yes, of course. This woman. Finicas. Her ship was called Siren Song. Finicas. Yes, I know the name. Last anyone heard, her ship was docked on the island of Naxos. <sighs> then we go to Naxos to see Finicas. Welcome back! Where shall we go? Barnabas! You'll never believe what happened in Nasara. Actually, you probably will. You have my full attention! I found the legendary labyrinth near Knossos! Did you go inside? I defeated the Minotaur! <laughs> That's quite a story. Story? These are the gods we're talking about, Inodotos! Tell me, what did the beast look like? Was he as ruthless as the legends say? He is. And smelled pretty bad, too. <laughs> How could anyone possibly believe? I ripped out one of his horns. By the gods. You're a hero of legend! And this artifact seems to have special abilities. The cult cannot get their hands on this. Are you excited? Nervous. What will I say to you? 
Alexios, you've traveled half the Greek world to 